it's your girl Gladys and welcome to Is That Your Hair? If you're new here, consider tapping that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. And if you've been rocking with me for a minute, what's up, what's good, and welcome back. Today is a very special video, y'all. I'm so excited. As some of you know, I have started doing try on hauls on my channel and I received such great feedback that I'm just gonna make it a thing on my channel. In the midst of me watching a ton of try on hauls, I found Liz Tool, and that's who I'm collabing with today. Liz is a freaking gem, y'all. She, to me, is like the queen of mid-sized try on hauls. She features a variety of brands on her channel and she's super informative. Literally anything that you want to know about a clothing item, she will tell you. She's very responsive in her comments. I love the items that she features for her body type and her personality is A1. Besides try on hauls, she also does vlogs and she does Q and A's, things like that. So please go show my girl Liz a ton of love. And Liz, I'm so glad that we agreed to collab with each other. This is gonna be really fun. I'll have Liz's information down in my description box. So make sure you go show my girl some love, okay? Okay. So Liz and I are both doing Amazon fall mid-size hauls and we got a ton of things to show you. I don't know why I do this to myself every freaking time I do a haul. I'm like, yo. But this is gonna be a long one, so make sure you grab a snack, okay? These are my measurements. I'm a 38, 40 double D, 34 waist, 43, 44 hip. Another thing that drew me to Liz is that we are similar sizes, like damn near almost the same size, except that Liz is 5'5 and I'm 5'3. So if you love my hauls, trust me, you're going to love hers as well. And if you find this video helpful, be sure to give this video a like and share this with a friend, okay? It's the first day of fall. We need to be ready. I'm a summer lover, and honestly, I'm still clinging on to it for dear life, but you know what? I think after doing this haul, I'm, I'm a given. I'm gonna just let fall take over. So if you're ready to see what I got, Keep on watching. Now in today's haul, I have a ton of items to show you. I have two piece sets, I have a few outfits, I have dresses, I have boots, shoes, sunglasses, I got a little bit of everything, okay? And we're gonna start off with the outfits and the two piece sets because I'm really feeling the items that I put together. So the first set we have here, we coming in hot, okay? This black number, <laughs> for, uh, I just, oh my gosh. I tried this on for y'all on Instagram and y'all were going crazy. Y'all loved it. I'm wearing this crisscross top and the long black skirt in a size medium and they are fitting me right, okay? Especially that crisscross top, y'all see that? The girls are sitting. One thing I love about this top is that it looks great on everyone that I've seen it on, literally everyone, no matter what your breast size is. So if you have larger breasts than I do, don't be afraid, sis. Go ahead and get this top. Add it to the cart. I just feel so sexy in it. And the black skirt, I love the material of it. I love the ruching. And I love a nice little mini skirt. It's just so felt and sexy to me. So these two items together meant to be a winner. And I hope y'all are here for me showing a little skin because I like showing skin all year round, no matter what the season, even in winter. <laughs> So if you are trying to step out of your comfort zone, you are in the right place. Let's keep it moving to the next one. So when I ordered this set, I was nervous because I don't think there were any reviews on this, but I was just like, let me just try it out. It took a little while to get to me, so I assume it's from out the country, but it's, it's bomb, y'all. It feels so smooth. It's not like cotton jersey material. It's like a slinky material. I love the green color on me. I think it's gorgeous. Oh my goodness, the keyhole design is very cute. And if you love a high slit, this is your fit. Straight up. <laughs> this is perfect for a date night out with your boo, your bae, your soon to be bae, maybe your FWB, no one's judging. I just love this. And as soon as I put this on, I was like, okay, who's taking me out? <laughs> So I definitely recommend this piece. I'm definitely gonna be wearing this out sometime soon on one of my nice fall nights, like as it gets a little bit cooler. Okay, on to the next outfit. I have three different items from Amazon. I have this sweater in a size medium, the skirt in a size 12, and these boots in a size eight and a half, yes. This just screams fall to me. Anytime I see someone pair a sweater with a skirt, I'm just like in love. And of course, with booties, why not? You can't go wrong. I will say these booties were a little bit tight. 
Like, I should have gotten a size 9, but I don't think it was available at the time. However, I'm very pleased with the skirt. It's a suede material, and it feels very good. I honestly could have gotten a size 10, because the 12 is definitely a bit loose on me. Even this medium sweater, I probably could have sized down to a small. One thing I noticed about the oversized items that I purchased in this haul, they're definitely oversized. I had to size down. And you'll see why as we keep going. But let me know. What do y'all think about that fit? Make sure you comment down below. Talk to me. Let me know what you think. We're only three outfits in. Are we here for it? All right. So this next outfit here is giving me summer, but make it fall. <laughs> the top that I'm wearing is an item that Liz recommended to me in a short sleeve version. But I opted for the long sleeve version instead. So thank you, Liz, because I love this top. I have it in a size large. And the skirt that I'm wearing that's actually a dress, I'll show y'all that later, I'm wearing in a size medium, and I just love the way this pairs together. I just think red and green for fall look perfect, and I love the sleeve prints. If you're going for a looser look like this, definitely get the top in a large. If you want something more forward-fitting, size down. But I think this just looks so good together. Oh my god. And I didn't point out the shoes that I'm wearing. These are from Shein. I've been rocking these shoes all summer and I will continue to rock them until it gets too cold outside. Also, you'll notice that I'm wearing these golden hoops. I got these from Etsy and I'm just so obsessed. Like chunky hoops are, they're definitely trending right now and I, I just love them so much. Normally I'm a big thin hoop kind of girl, but the chunky ones are cute. Do y'all have a pair of these? If not, pick them up. These are awesome and they're supposed to not turn for a while. And I've been rocking them and, and they haven't been turning. So I think it's living up to what the claim is. All right, next outfit. Are we here for shorts in the fall? I am. I wear shorts all year round. I don't care. Look, throw on a sweater like this, an oversized sweater with your favorite pair of shorts and some knee high boots and you're golden. I really like this look. It's very comfortable to me. It's very chic. I would pair this with a nice, you know, crossbody bag or even like a big handheld bag and I think you'd be good to go. I'd probably put up my hair in a top knot or something like that. I really love this look. Let me know if you wear shorts all year round like I do. I don't want to be the only one. <laughs> now one thing I will say about these shorts, these are not stretchy. I have them in a size 12. They are definitely, you know, no stretch whatsoever, but I really like them. I felt like they were super stiff when I first tried them on, but now that I've worn them like three times, they've been loosening up, and I imagine it'll continue to do so as I wash them too, so I'm here for these. There's no type of tag on it. These are from Amazon, and you'll find them linked down below. All these items are linked in the description box, y'all, and I have it organized to the best of my ability, so that way it's easy for y'all to shop. And of course, when you shop through my links, you are supporting is that your hair. Okay, I love that. And thank you to everyone who has been supporting me because I see y'all. Thank you, it makes a really big difference. This fit right here. I posted this on IG and a lot of you were hitting me up asking for the link. Now you have it. The, the shades, the sweater, ugh. I have the off the shoulder sweater in a size small. Like I said, these oversized items are very oversized, so I had to size down in order for it to fit the way I want it. And this skirt, oh my goodness, this is a corduroy skirt, y'all. I have not worn corduroy since I was like seven, and I used to hate it back then, but now I adore it because of this skirt. I just think I look so fall ready. Like, this is quintessential fall outfit. Liz, would you rock something like this? Let me know. I, I can see you rocking something like this. And I also opted to pair it with a belt because I just, like the cinched look for this outfit. I think it looks really good. This outfit is actually one of my favorite outfits I put together from this haul, and I hope that you all like it too. Also, another thing that I like about the items that I bought, y'all, I'm pretty sure everything is under $30. Like, almost positive everything is under $30. So super affordable. That's what I love about Amazon. And if there's something that you buy that you don't like that doesn't fit you well, returns are a breeze. Sometimes you don't even have to label it or package it. You can just return it as is, and they'll package it for you. So. Amazon be coming through. And I love that I'm finding all these cute affordable items. <laughs> I love this one. Okay, I know I said the last outfit was my favorite, but this is another one of my favorites. I brought the, the corduroy skirt back, paired it with this printed top. That's one little fashion tip I have for you. If you wanna venture into prints, pair it with like a solid at the bottom. I think this is such a look. I mean, I got my girls out. They're sitting upright. I have on this nice necklace that I got from this black owned business. I'll link it down below. I love that choker necklace. All of this is just a vibe. In the black booties that I'm wearing, I have them in a size nine. 
they are definitely whoo they're snug but i can tell that these booties are gonna loosen up as i actually wear them because i haven't worn them out yet but what do y'all think about this outfit she cute <laughs> i don't think i've ever been this excited about fall clothes before like fall fashion is definitely a thing but because i'm such a summer lover i'm like eh, okay let's just skip over this but this year i'm really i'm really into it let me know in the comments which season is your favorite which season makes your fashion style just pop you know i would love to know all right so this next outfit here all black everything what i'm here for it i bought these leather leggings because of liz Liz bought a pair of leather leggings, so I bought a pair of leather leggings. <laughs> and I love the way they look. I have them in a size extra large. They fit great. The bodysuit that I have on is a cotton jersey material. Size medium, fits me well, no complaints there. Although I do wish it was more like a spandex material. I feel like it's not gonna last too long after a few washes. And then I brought the boots back, the black boots, with this black belt. This entire outfit is from Amazon, and I'm pretty sure when you put it all together, it's maybe under $150. Come on, y'all, you can't beat that. You can't beat that. Are you adding this one to the cart? Because this is giving me, I'm going out with my girls and I don't know what time I'm coming home. <laughs> Let me know what you think because I am here for this. Now for this next outfit, I have the same leggings in a different color and the red color. I actually got the red in a size large and once I realized I didn't like the fit, I got the black and the extra large. I'm returning these. I mean, I like the look, but it came with like a mark on it. I was not feeling that. But I love the look of this with the cream turtleneck. I actually am really feeling this turtleneck, y'all. And I, I mean, this is almost making me think of the holidays. Like, are the holidays coming early? Let me know. And I absolutely love that I chose to wear my hair in a half up, half down with that. Also, if you're curious about the hair, because I know y'all noticed for all my wig babes who like to watch me, this hair is by Outre. This is Outre Nisha H301. She comes longer. I cut her recently because she was getting a little ragged, okay? I'll link her down below because she is still everything. I absolutely love that I cut her to this length. I think it's a perfect look, especially when you're wearing off the shoulder tops like this one. Yes! I'll link this top down below. I wasn't really showcasing it. I mean, y'all could see it or whatever, but it's too big for me. <laughs> so I was like, let me just wear it on camera because I still love the color. I mean, this is my favorite fall color. I still recommend it. I just think you need to size down like one or two sizes. This is a medium and it's going like this. Yeah, so size down. Okay, for this next outfit, I have three items from Amazon. These jeans that fit super comfortable, I have them in a size extra large. They're not too tight, but they're not too loose either. I really love that, and they're distressed, so I definitely recommend them. They do have stretch, awesome. Also, these flats are my everyday work flats. I've been wearing them like nonstop, and they come with memory foam, so I really love that. This top that I'm wearing though, I took a chance on it, and I actually really love the print. It feels almost like paper though, like it's very stiff. I feel like it just needs to loosen up after some wearing or after one wash. It wasn't closing over my breasts, so I just decided, hey, I'm gonna just wear this joint out. Like this is what we're doing. <laughs> and I'm here for it. When I showed this to y'all on Instagram, I was asking like what bra I should wear underneath because I wouldn't wear the black bra. I would wear probably like a nude or a white or even pink. A few of y'all suggested pink too. So let me know in the comments what kind of bra or bralette you would wear underneath that top but all together i really really like that look it's giving spring vibes but we're bringing it into fall speaking of spring vibes this outfit right here definitely screams spring but who said you only have to wear bright colors in the spring or summertime i wear bright colors in the fall as well once i saw this online i was like i gotta try it the one thing i thought was so unique about this is the fact that the skirt is a button-up skirt like in the middle i hadn't seen that but of course if you want to switch it to the side you can i think it's a very cute look i got this outfit in extra large and i'm glad that i did because i was scared the buttons would like get spacey and they they don't so that's great and i love the the tie up top i just think this is a very cute look okay so here i, I took a little risk here y'all this blazer i wasn't sure how it was going to turn out but I actually like it and I, I paired it with the sweater and we're here with the shorts again because we wear shorts all year round over here I think it came together nicely 
The blazer quality is not like top notch or anything. It's definitely on the thin side and it feels almost like paper. It did come very wrinkled so I put it in the dryer and like let it spin and rotate for like 10 minutes before wearing it to get some of the wrinkles out. But altogether, I like the look of it so I'm gonna keep it. I know that if I wanted to get this blazer elsewhere, it would cost a lot more money for that type of print pattern like the houndstooth, so I'm here for it. Let me know if you like the blazer short sweater combination. I think having a blazer is a fall staple and I think it's nice to have like a solid color and then a nice print to really jazz up your jean outfits or maybe a skirt because I would wear that with a skirt as well, maybe like a black leather skirt. Let me know what y'all think, but that is definitely my vibe. All right, y'all, we are done with the outfits. It's time to get into some dresses. So let's start with this dress right here. I bought this dress because of Liz. We recommended some items to each other for our haul, and I chose this one out of what she recommended to me, and I love it. I feel like Liz knows my, my style so well now. This black number, first of all, black looks good on everyone. It's definitely very slimming. It covers any areas that you don't want to show. And hello, do you see my girls in this dress? I feel like this is a dress that you can dress up or dress down. I like the versatility of that. The fabric feels very nice too. Like I think this is gonna last a while, even through washing and whatnot. So Liz, thank you so much for recommending that dress because I'm definitely wearing that. I I'm so ready to rock it. Now I also bought this style of dress in two other colors. So this red color that you see here, if you don't want it to look dressy, if you want it to look more sporty, here's an idea for you. You can wear a white hat, this red dress, and these white fila sneakers. One of my homegirls has been rocking her filas all summer, so I was inspired by my girl Nikki. Love you, boo. <laughs> I just think this is such a cute look. <laughs> I love it. It's giving me like 2003 vibes, like I just finished listening to Ashanti and Murder Inc. at a concert. <laughs> Let me know what y'all think about this vibe. I don't usually wear white Kangol style hats, but I tried it and now I'm into it. I also really love the material of this dress. It's smooth on the outside and it's like a soft, cottony feel on the inside, like pillowy soft. Definitely great for the cooler months that are coming. All right, y'all, we are back. It's taken me two days to film this, so I'm back with a new top on, new earrings. Y'all should definitely check out this black owned business. I love these earrings. The earrings that she gifted me are so ornate. Just absolutely beautiful. Definitely check my girl Janine out at QTScollection.com. I'll leave it a link in the description box because the jewelry that I see on her website, I definitely don't see it in other places. So I highly recommend you check her out, especially if you want to support and shop black owned. As far as this top that I'm wearing, this is one of my favorite summer tops. It's a imitation leather pleather top. And I just feel like it looks so good on. This is a size large. I actually got this from Shein, but they have the same top on Amazon. I'll link it down below as well in case you're interested. I love it so much. It's definitely stretchy too. Speaking of Shein, do y'all want to see a Shein home? Low-key, I've been <laughs> a little torn about Shein because they was acting up earlier this year. So I don't know. But if y'all want to see it, let me know in the comments. Back to the dresses, y'all. I have another zipper dress, and I love it just as much as I love the black and the red one. The difference with this is that there is a pattern on the actual dress it's, instead of it being just a solid, smooth color. I got this one in a size large, and I do notice a difference. I think I like the fit of the large better. It just feels like a more comfortable fit. The medium in the red was definitely very snug. I'm still gonna rock it, I still like it, but I still feel like it teetered on being almost too tight. Whereas this tan colored one fits amazingly. And of course, I love the way my girls are looking in the dress. This is what I love about the zip up dress. You can wear a regular bra, regular push up bra, zip it down a little bit, have a little party in the front. <laughs> and keep it moving. Speaking of bras, this is the bra that I'm wearing underneath that dress. I got this bra from Amazon. It's a perfect everyday push-up bra. It does have padding, which normally I prefer not to have padding, but it's not a big deal to me. The bra is very comfortable on, and this is coming from someone who does not like wearing bras, okay? I will go braless seven days a week if I could, but I go to work and I move around a lot, so I just, I just put on a bra. So if you are interested in buying a new bra, a new bra that is inexpensive but still good quality, highly recommend this one here. 
Here's the next dress, a red dress. I haven't purchased a red dress in a while, probably since pre-COVID. I like this one. What do y'all think? First of all, the ruching alone is a highlight for me for this dress. Ruching just makes everyone's body just look so good, so curvaceous, and that's what I like. So I love the fit of this dress. I love that it's a midi length. I just think it looks great on me. I think it's the perfect little red dress. So if you're looking for one for a nice night out, try this one out. I think you'll like it. I feel like those spaghetti straps are adjustable, but definitely check through the links to make sure. Either way, can't go wrong with this one. Okay, now this black dress, I have it in a size large. I definitely could have sized down to a medium because literally this is a zip up dress and I put it on without even put it, pulling down the zipper. I would say just get your size. The highlight are the sleeves. The sleeves are so freaking cute. Do y'all see that? The little puff sleeve. And, and this dress does come in multiple colors. I think I like six or seven colors. Maybe you wanna try out something different like a red or maybe a white. I would love to see what the white looks like. But this black, I think it's so classy. It definitely makes me wanna go to an all black affair. Let me know what you feel about this one in the comments. If you have somewhere to go for the holiday season, I think you should put this one in the cart. And even feeling the material of the dress, it's definitely a quality material. For a dress that is under $30, like, really Amazon? I'm impressed. Okay, y'all, this dress right here, y'all would not believe how much I paid for this maxi length, sexy black turtleneck dress. I paid $12.99, y'all, $12.99. And at the time, it said I, had the, I got the last one. But they just restocked. So if you like the way this looks over here, go add to the cart right now before it sells out again. Because the other ones that look like this are definitely $24 in that type of range, which is still very affordable. But if you can pay $12.99, come on, sis, why wouldn't you? Look at me! <laughs> it feels super smooth. It's definitely not a jersey cotton material, giving me more of a spandex vibe. I got it in a size medium, and at first putting it on, the turtleneck felt so tight. I was like, oh, is this gonna fit me? But as soon as I got past my shoulders, it fit like a dream. There was no issue. So I think I'd recommend going with your size. If you want a little bit of a looser fit, size up. Okay, so next we have this sweater dress. Ah, I already told y'all that this, the rust orange color is like my favorite fall color. And this oversized sweater is just giving me life. If you like oversized sweaters, this is the one for you. It's a nice sweater dress. You can pair this with some nice ankle boots, mid-calf boots, knee-high, thigh-high boots, whatever. Just make sure you size down depending on the look that you want. I size down to a small. Normally, I'm a very true medium in dresses. So one size down for me, it might be two sizes because when they say oversized, like I said earlier, they mean oversized. So it just depends on how you want it to look. And that leads me to this. Please make sure you are looking through these Amazon reviews because they're very helpful to me in deciding what items I can choose to do these hauls. If it weren't for the reviews, I don't know. I'd just be picking things very blindly, which would make me very uncomfortable, especially when you're spending your own money. So please look through those reviews, watch YouTube videos like myself and like Liz. We put in a lot of work to do this for y'all so that y'all can make the most informed decision and look fly on a budget, okay? Here I have another sweater dress. I got this in a light pink color. I originally wanted it in a green color, but I think it was sold out in the small. I just love the way this fits on my body. I love the relaxed look of the sleeves and the fact that it falls past my thighs. This sweater is it. It's so comfy, so cute, but you're still giving a little bit of oomph, you know what I mean? I'm really feeling the whole turtleneck style. Turtlenecks are just so into me, and I hope you're into them too because I know I have quite a few of them in this haul. But this dress right here, comfy, cute. I mean, what more can you ask for? Go get it. Now this dress is actually more of a summertime dress, but we are bringing this one into fall. I love the olive color. I have it in a size medium. This is a nice midi, midaxi type of dress. The material feels super soft, y'all. Love the way this material feels. I actually wore this to work the other day with a big teacher sweater and I just felt so comfortable moving around. It's one of those dresses that, you know, you can make it work for the workplace, maybe if you throw on like a blazer or something. But as soon as it's time for happy hour, you take whatever you're wearing off and you just let yourself shine. I decided to pair this with a denim jacket. If y'all are familiar with my style, y'all know that I love denim. And I like to incorporate it as much as I can. So having a denim jacket is definitely a staple for fall. 
I haven't tried any from Amazon, but I will definitely research some for y'all. Overall, I love the look of that green tube top dress. To me, no qualms about it, and it's super affordable. I believe in the $20 price range, or maybe like right under it. Everything will be linked in the description box, so please make sure you read through the description box. And of course, if you have questions, you can always comment to me. Maybe I missed something, and I will help you out the best way I can. Okay, now this next dress. As soon as I put it on, I was like, wow, this dress looks really good on me. Another dress that has ruching, and it's just making my curves pop. I also really love this like dusty, um, how would I say, like camel, beige, khaki color. I think it looks really good on my skin. I normally like a cowl neck, and the cowl neck is the neck that kind of like ruffles in the front. But it wasn't quite working for me, so I decided to tuck the straps in and just wear it as a tube top dress. I like that look better. Just take your time when you're tucking it in. So I just wanted to show y'all that because even though the cowl neck started to bother me, I made it work. And that goes with any item that you buy that you really, really like, but there's this one thing that's off about it. You know, sometimes it's worth it to take your time and maybe try to style it in an alternative way to see you know if it can work for you all right next dress here is a simple easy peasy breezy maxi dress this is the type of dress that i wear to work i bought a, a version of this dress last year i think in a different color you can't go wrong especially when you have pockets like we all love pockets if you want something that's going to cover your arms as the days get chillier you want something with good stretch you want something with pockets and that is nice and flowy and flattering and also you know if you want to hide your tummy because some people don't want to show their stomach. Get a dress like this. Trust me, it's going to look really good on you. It's soft, it's stretchy. It's just a, a straight to the point type of maxi dress. So I highly recommend this one. Okay, and now for our last dress. I saw quite a few reviews with people wearing it in this color, so I had to go get it. And I really, really, really like the pattern on this dress. I just like t-shirt dresses. I would definitely pair this with the black booties or even with some knee-high boots. As you can see, I wore the black belt to cinch it in, but I'm also wearing it without the belt because I just wanted you to see, like you don't always have to cinch in your waist. You can wear things loosely and just let it fall on your body as it may, you know what I mean? Now my only real con to this shirt dress is that the inside is white. I don't like that. I don't like what I get, whether it be t-shirts, skirts, swimsuits when it's like the pattern on the outside and white on the inside. I wish that wasn't a thing, especially the way I want to wear this with, you know, my girls out, the white's exposed, but it's not a huge deal, but I still love it. I mean, do y'all see this pattern? I think it's so pretty. Oh, Amazon, you did good with that one. And I'm surprised there's actually a little bit of stretch in this material too. I thought it was gonna be a bit more crisp, but yeah, that's good. Now, before we go, I want to highlight these shoes that you saw in the haul, but I didn't really get to talk about. These Fila's, I haven't worn them out yet, but who knew chunky shoes were so cute on the foot? <laughs> I saw them on my homegirl, and they looked cute on her, but I was like, I don't really think I want them for me. But I was like, you know, let me go get them. And I like them. And Amazon actually has a size eight and a half for like $39.99 now. Like when I bought it, it was definitely almost $70. So, I, and I bought these sneakers like a month ago, but I think it was because it was so hot outside. Now that it's cooling down on the East Coast, you know, the prices are dropping. So you may as well add this one to the cart. I also really, really like the look of these black booties, but I have to stretch them out. If you have a wide foot, these boots are not for you. It's gonna hurt unless you get it in like a nine wide, 10 wide, something like that. But in the regular sizing, I don't think it accommodates a wider foot. Still a very good look though, if you can make it work. And then these two pairs of flats I have here, I've been wearing the solid um, camel color flats almost every day to work. And these leopard print flats, I really, really like them. I love the look. I just noticed that they've been like rubbing against one toe that I have a corn on. <laughs> so I need to like get that together. <laughs> But other than that, they look so good on the foot. And I think if you don't have any corns like me, you should be good. You should be comfortable. <laughs> All right, y'all. So that is it for this Amazon fall try on haul. Woo, your girl is exhausted. How about y'all? Y'all made it to the, if y'all made this far in the video, thank you so much. 
Please comment down below and let me know what your favorite items are. Which ones did you add to the cart? Which ones did you already buy before the end of this video? <laughs> Be honest, it's a safe space here. And make sure you go check out my girl Liz Tool. Liz, mwah, I love you so much. Thank you so much for this awesome collaboration. Liz, you are a gem and I love seeing you grow. By the way, Liz and I are both on the road to 30,000 subscribers, okay? So if you are new to us, if you're new to our channel, what are you waiting for, sis? Go ahead, tap the subscribe button. Make sure you hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. And if you wanna see some more of my try on hauls, definitely check them out over here to the right of me. Thank you all so much for joining me. Premiere party, mwah. I love y'all, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.